Ladies and gentlemen, the FIFA Ballon d'Or 2015 goes to Lionel Messi. For a record fifth time, Lionel Messi was awarded the title of best player in the world. It seems the accolades never stop for Barcelona and Argentina's leading man. We've shared a lot together, and this is our 10th consecutive year at the Ballon d'Or. Both Cristiano and Messi are out of this world. He's a fantastic player, the player that has won the most Ballon d'Ors. That's why he's a fantastic player. Messi, Messi the best, the one and only. A genius. The speed in which he can change direction is incredible. The speed in which he thinks about his next move and the way he changes his direction, it's just amazing. I'm not as good as him at these things, especially the changing direction, going one way and then the other. I couldn't do that, and I don't think anyone else can either. I think a lot has changed. Many years have passed since my first award in 2009. You grow, you learn things, and you change in football and in life. A lot has changed. Hopefully we'll carry on being successful. I feel much better at the moment, more relaxed. It's much better to work this way. I'm full of dreams, and I want to be able to repeat it all. But as it happened, it took 12 months for us to get where we wanted to be. You must remain calm, because football is always changing. Much may have changed in football since 2009, but there remain constants, like Messi's ability to dazzle opponents and fans, and despite some rumors to the contrary, his loyalty to the club that gave him his chance and where he enjoyed another great year. It's football. Anything can happen in football. Things can happen in much shorter periods of time. I was always relaxed, and I always said I was happy where I was. So I kept things that way, and luckily, it ended up being a very good year for all of us. And in 2015, it was a superstar triumvirate with Luis Suarez and Neymar that Messi relished, after a period of adjustment. Of course, it was very hard at the beginning, because everything had changed. But I think we did what we had to do and did what the coach wanted. Things began to work and we kept improving. It's the good chemistry that exists between the three of us on and off the pitch, the type of people we all are. The fact that the three of us want the best for the team and for the good of the group. This comes before anything else. Genius. I learn so much from Lionel every day. And I'll continue to learn from him every day, hoping I can play as well as him in the future. I get on really well with Neymar. He's always said wonderful things about me ever since his first day. The truth is, that it makes me very happy that a friend and teammate talks about me this way. Barcelona won their fifth trophy of 2015 when they beat Argentina's River Plate in the FIFA Club World Cup final. But the victory was bittersweet for the Argentinian superstar. It was the effort of all those people that traveled to Japan, the dream they had. And it's hard for me as an Argentinian to have scored the first goal and ruined all that. I didn't ask for forgiveness, but I do feel guilty somehow. Since starring at the 2005 Under-20 World Cup, Messi has played more than 100 times for his country, as captain since 2011. At the 2014 FIFA World Cup, he was named player of the tournament, despite Argentina losing in the final. A year later, at the Copa America, they would again lose at the last hurdle. We can't wait to end this and to be able to win a title for the national team. 
título con la selección que Because I think we do deserve it after all we've been through. Todos los que venimos peleando ya. We played many finals without being able to win them and well it will certainly happen at some point. Messi and his team will have another chance at the Copa America Centenary in June. And having played his club football away from home since he was 13, Messi hopes to return to Argentina one day. Sí, siempre lo dije, ¿no? Yes, I've always said so. Because I've wanted that ever since I was a child and because of how things happened to me. I didn't do it when I was young because I happened to be in Europe with Barcelona. I spent all my career here, but I really would like to go back to Argentinian football one day. What will happen? Well, only God knows. Después de acá lo que pase, solo Dios sabe.